Well, it was a wet spring that brought constant rain and the farmers are feeling it. Fox 47's Christiana Ford talks to the farmers at the East Lansing Farmers Market to see how they're managing record rain. Now, vendors tell me this is the first good weather day they've had since the market started this year, and they have a good amount of people here today to show for it. Hi there. We've been here at the East Lansing Farmers Market for 11 years. We've been farming full time for about 20 years. Poe Stevenson says that's 20 years rain or shine, and like many farmers, been hit this year with a little too much rain. We have standing water on some of our fields still, and it's prevented us from planting a lot of our main crops. We have our spring crops in, but we haven't been able to plant in earnest for about six, seven weeks. The crops Pooh has here are just a product of the 40% she has planted. Usually she says she'd be about 80% done by now. Phil Troop, owner of Wildflower Eco Farm, can't agree. It's caused a delay on some things. Um, I'm lucky in that I'm enrolling uh, well-drained soil, so um, I can't plant the day of a rain, but if it's dry for a day or two, then I'm okay. Like Pooh, Phil has been a vendor at East Lansing Farmers Market since the beginning. Diversity is really the key to being able to be successful in a farmers market. Surprisingly, things like kohlrabi do really well. Um, so it's funny what niches you find, things you wouldn't expect, you know. Who would have thought kohlrabi would be a big seller, you know. But. The weather hasn't discouraged them from sharing their produce with the community. I'm honored to be a farmer, you know, I mean, it is a really um, special relationship we have not only with the ground that we grow on, the plants that we plant, the vegetables that we harvest, but the relationship that we have with the customers. Um, they are, they genuinely do appreciate the food. This farmer's market caters to growers like them. Everything is 100% handmade or grown. Every once in a while, we'll have a regular customer that comes and they'll buy all of their produce from us and they'll make a special meal on that Sunday with just stuff from the farmer's market. So it's kind of special in that way, yeah. The market will be here every Sunday until October 27th. You can check out the weekly lineup on cityofeastlansing.com. Thanks. Now, the city of East Lansing says the market draws a crowd of 1,000 visitors to Valley Court Park on market days.